wild deer here look at that they're running away oh there's a big family over there look at that it's crazy Konnichiwa. this is so relaxing good morning people it's 6 40 in the morning our bikes are loaded and we're ready to hit the road kaito as usual is getting his bike clean <laughs> There's not a day it goes by without Kaito cleaning his motorbike. <laughs> we woke up at 5 in the morning and guys, there have been lots of people coming already to this campsite. And the reason is they love this hot spring and they come here every day to take uh, the bed. I heard from Kaito yesterday that many locals are around here. They don't even uh, they don't even take a shower in their houses because they have this hot spring here for free. So they love coming here even in winter. They come and enjoy this hot spring every day. That's crazy, right? We're gonna go get some breakfast. I heard there is a Seiko Mart a convenience store uh, just about three minutes from here. Um, so we're gonna stop there, buy something, maybe some onigiri, and then we're gonna roll. I'm gonna tell you what the plan is for today after breakfast. Ready? Let's roll. We're not forgetting anything. Okay. What a great campsite. I oh, didn't see the bears. I was hoping to see a bear. Uh, oh, we got um, our towels uh, on top of my bags. They're still super wet from yesterday. Uh, since we were like in the middle of the forest, kind of, there was no sun coming in this morning, so the towels didn't didn't get dry. Look, these people here are already soaking in the hot spring over there. Wow, it was really a great, great, great place. Look at the steam coming up from there. This hot spring is actually 90 degrees hot. That's a lot, you know, and they have these tubes to take the water, the 90 degrees water, all the way to the hot springs, which is not very far, but you know, the, of course the temperature lowers a little bit and they mix it only a little bit with cold water. So honestly, it was pretty, pretty, pretty hot yesterday when going in. It's a little bit cloudy today. I think there's gonna be heavy rain here in the afternoon. So we need to leave this place as soon as possible. Okay, first stop, Seiko Mart. Look, this little kid going to school now. Uh, it's really nice, even in these places, walking, you know, onto school. Who knows how far it is? The school in these rural areas have very few students. Um, it can be honestly even seven students in elementary school and maybe even two, three students in junior high school. Um, so these schools will eventually, in a couple of years, completely close. We found Seiko Mart. Next park somewhere here. Okay. Seiko Mart is now our restaurant. The order I chose was tomato cheese pizza. Oh, it's so good. And I'm eating this every day. Soba is 110 yen. This. あとね、とろろ、ネギトロ、納豆、納豆はもう毎日食べてますよ。あとオリが大好きなこれ梅、カリカリ梅、ノーニギです。いただきます。ウェンプロベチョ。The weather seems to be changing very very fast here. The sea is right there, but as you can see, we can barely see a thing. We're running away from this place, guys. We don't want any rain. So we're going away as fast as we can, away from this place. Okay, two days plan. We're gonna be riding along the east coast of Hokkaido, down south. We're gonna be visiting another peninsula, Notsuke Peninsula. And then we're gonna go even more to the south, 
and we're gonna stay at a campsite where you can see sea otters how cool is that i hope the weather is gonna be fine because i really want to see them look at that fog you guys Whoa. it is actually pretty cold right now with the wind we receive when riding Woo! i just heard from kaito the campsite we're gonna be staying at it's called kiritapu and kiritapu literally means like tick fog um, so it is not known to be the most sunny place but hopefully we'll be lucky and we'll get some sun down there <laughs> I'm loving today's route as well. Look at that. Five minutes ago, we were riding next to the sea and now in between trees. How cool is that? Well, I must say it is pretty cold today. Honestly, what a change from yesterday. I was already getting used to the heat and now it's really cold again. We are currently entering the Notsuke Peninsula. There is no way out of here. We need to come back uh, through the same route, but we still want to make it. Maybe this place is only meant for fishers to come. Look at these houses, abandoned. If you guys see this place from above using Google Maps, you're gonna see it is a very narrow peninsula. So right there on the right, well, it's foggy right now, so we can't see a thing, but the, the sea is like 50 meters from here, and we got the sea on this side too. So really, it is very, very narrow. This is the only road on this peninsula. Look, you can see it clear from here. The sea just right there, just right there, and just right here as well. Look at that. Oh, it's nice and warm here. It's so weird. Some people cleaning the net, the fishing nets there. Entering the super foggy zone in three, two, one. Whoa. It is so cold again now. You cannot even see 50 meters um, to the left. All you can see is white. You can barely see the boats. Look at that. It's crazy. <laughs> we just saw a couple of deer, wild deer here. Look at that. They're running away. Wow. Oh, there's a big family over there. Look at that. Over there, Boo, on the right big family of deer about 10 15 deer i would say wow
こんな野生の鹿を見るのは人生で初めてですよ、皆さん絶対に来た方がいいです、野付岬、正直、この先端に、あそこにもいますね、ほら、すぐそこに顔を上げた、<笑>ごめんね、怖がらして、いや、正直、この野付岬って、先端まで行くの結構時間かかるんですよ、結構時間かかる上にもまっすぐで、霧がすごいんで、あんま見えなくて、あんま面白くはないんですけど、来るまではね、けど、ここで見た景光系っていうのはすごいですね、いやー、こんなやっぱ野生動物って素敵ですね、初めてですよ、日本でもこういうのが見れるっていうのが、すごいな、北海道、本当にすごいですよ、うわー、そこにもいる、いっぱいいる、見えますか、皆さん、あ本当にいっぱいいるんだね。来るときは全然気づかなかったのに奈良とかでもいっぱいいますけどね彼らはもう人懐っこいというか人が餌をあげてるんで来るし近寄ってくるし彼ら角がないじゃないですかここのはもう立派な角が生えてますよあれは確かに突撃されたら一発で終わりますねうわまたすごい霧がさっきよりも濃くなってる建物の上側が全然今見えません昨日が30度ですよ30度で暑い暑いって言ったのにむちゃくちゃ寒い今うわ霧が本当にすごいな前が全然見えないおおすごいねこのバイクお後ろにトレーラーまでいいねかっこいいねいやだいぶ天気変わりました5分も走ってないと思うけど切り抜けたら晴れましたわすごい天気の変わりを暖かくもなったしね見てください皆さん僕らが走ってるとこんなところですよ野付<笑>半島出ました野付半島出た瞬間に気温がむちゃくちゃ変わりましたかなり暖かいそして快晴気持ちいいですよこのまま海沿いを今から走って南側に行きますそうするとまたちょっと出っ張ってるところがいろいろあるんで岬みたいなところがあるんでそういったところを今回攻めていこうと思いますよはい今日なんか天気がおかしいですね、うん、今日は曇りだったんだけど、晴れちゃったもんね。<笑>本当だ雨、雨だった、雨みたいに感じちゃった。さっき野付岬まで行ったら、すごい霧でしたよ。そうですか。うん。あ,ありがとうございます。よっしゃ、行くぜ。出発。すごい荷物だね。かっこいい。ハーレーは荷物が乗りやす、乗せやすそうだね。かなりの荷物を乗せて走ってる人たちをハーレーの中でいっぱい見ますまたもう霧がすごいよ海なのか雪なのかわかんねえもんこれ北海道冬だったらマジでわかんないと思うわまあわかるけどね<笑>いやすごいですどんどん霧が深くなってますまずい僕らが今から行くとは霧タップですよキリタップはどんだけ霧がすごいんだっていうねこんなにこの場所で霧がすごいならまずいですよここが海のはずなのに何も見えねえ本当に何も見えねえカラスも見えてないんじゃないかなどこ飛んでるか<笑>おかっこいいライダーたち
おい元気かいみんな<笑>旅を楽しんでるかい完全にミストタウンですねここはすごいなずーっとこんなのかなここら辺の街って根室まで6 7キロですもはやここが霧サップなんじゃないんですか皆さん<笑>どんだけ霧が濃いのここ<笑>全然先が見えねえ 50m 先が見えないですちょっと道を外れて今また岬の違う岬があるんですそこに今向かってます名前は分かりませんしかしどこもあれですね霧が<笑>霧がすごくて何も見えないただここもまたいるんじゃないワイルドディアたちが人気もない家もない車も通らないなのに電柱があるっていうのが日本のすごいところですよ<笑>この先に家があるってことかな電線があるってことはそうだよね何かがあるってことだよ<笑>見てくださいポツンポツンポツンと3軒だけ家があるって面白いです<笑>住んではないね完全に捨てられてるね多分すげえなものすごい寂しいねもうほぼ先端ですよ急に大量の家が出てきましたこれすごいちゃんとした街があるうわ学校なんとかセンターすごいねこんな先端に街がありますよわお多分学校もあるんじゃないかなあ行き止まりですついに先端に着きました<笑>先端に着きましたねおりちゃん日本一周する人。こんにちは。日本一周してますか。そうそうそうそう。ええー。いつから始まる。ええー、十二月。十二月そうそう。え、すごい。え、同じね。<笑>え、名前は何ですか。カイド。カイド、うん。私のアポロです。あ、これ。あ、これ。これの名前や。シーク。の名前はなくは。頑張ってくださいはいまたねはいはいわお、how cool is that that guy is going around Japan we've met so many people traveling around Hokkaido you guys by bicycle, by motorbike, camping car, walking I mean I guess it's just whatever you wanna do you just gotta go and do it Wow, it's about 11 in the morning.、Um, we had two choices either keep on riding to visit some other places or just head down to the campsite. We decided today、uh, to go to the campsite. These last couple of days, we've been arriving quite late at the campsite and we didn't have much time just to sit back and relax. So, what we want to do is、uh, maybe find something to eat. I don't know if there's going to be anything. Uh, along the road, but we'll see, and then just go to the campsite. And probably we're gonna spend a couple of days there, and we're gonna go around to visit some places. Whoa, look at all these green pastures! Beautiful. It's weird to see these vast lands without any,、um, any agriculture on it, just grass. This is so weird to see in Japan. It is very, very rare. Look on this side as well. Ah,、uh, some cows over here. What a weird looking cloud over there. It looks like a mountain. You know, but it's actually a cloud. It looks, it is very, very low.
we're going on a little exploration trip along these beautiful countryside roads the problem is most of these side roads are with these little um, stones which is really really hard on my motorbike uh, it feels really unstable Kaito is absolutely enjoying this road his motorbike is like it's a hybrid it is meant for the regular road and to go off-road as well but not mine I'm eating all of Kaito's dust Oh, oh yeah, at least we're meeting new friends Hi there Okay, that was a little fun detour Now it's time to go back to the normal, to the normal road I think the campsite we're staying at tonight, it's right over there um, I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but you see a piece of land there and then it disappears It's not the end of the land, it's just that it's covered by a thick layer of fog all the way there Crazy We are arriving at the campsite Doesn't seem to be that windy yet but we met someone at a convenience store a couple minutes ago and he told us that it gets pretty windy up here and pretty foggy and the tents get pretty wet as well <laughs> um, we'll see how it goes apparently we need to register somewhere here it's a free campsite um, but we have to register here at this um, information center I guess the hot springs are back there where we parked the bikes and now we're heading to the campsite and I thought it was walking distance, but you know, if we have to walk all that way for the shower um, It's quite a long way, so I guess we'll have to take the bikes just to shower Wow, they're drying um, algae here Look at that, Hokkaido algae, it's really really famous I don't like algae, but everybody says the, um, the algae from here tastes really really good And look at that they dry it one by one they're drying all of that wow they're horses look at that oh no definitely it's definitely impossible to walk all this distance just to go to shower wow there is so much fog my god the fog is crazy look at that I can only see Kaito ahead of me Where's the campsite? It's gonna be really cold tonight Where's the entrance? Here, boo, no? Kiritapu Kampujo We made it to Kiritapu campsite and guys, it is super foggy Check this out We park our bikes over there and now more and more people are coming here It is a very popular place uh, You see there's a few people camping here There's uh, other people staying at the bungalows And we chose this spot This is our Lone Rider tent Which by the way guys, if you're interested in a motorcycle tent In a very lightweight tent and somehow a home on the road uh, we recommend you check this tent we got a link in our description 
if you want to check it out. We got all our stuff here organized and we have a separate space to sleep over there. Very comfortable and we even have this owning kit. Very nice. Neighbor. Cheers. Wow, what a special view.霧は最初見ると、わ、すごいな、綺麗だなって思いますけど。開きます。何にも見えません。そして今こうやって温泉に向かって歩いてるわけですよ。30分ぐらい降りが歩こうっていうから、しょうがなく歩きます今から。